All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Reincarnated as a Slime, Season 3, Episode 8. In the last episode, Hinata and her squad were on our way to Tempest to find out if Rimuru really does want to fight or if he can. They can just kind of resolve everything we're talking. Obviously, uh, with people maneuvering shit in the background, um, lack of communication or messed up communication got in the way. They ended up pulling up to Tempest and they find that the Rimuru and co are attacking the Holy Knights that didn't say they were going to come, but for some reason have. Uh, Hinata doesn't know why. Um, but really, it's like like we say, miscommunication on both sides. Rimuru thinks she wants to fight. Hinata thinks he wants to fight. So yeah, I guess we'll see what's going to happen here. Presumably, they're just going to fight it out. I mean, the best outcome would be they talk. But uh, a little bit of action, never killed nobody, I guess. Or maybe it will, who knows. But yeah, very excited for this episode. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, it's Valentine. Oh, why is she naked too? Who the, who the... Who is this? Is it like burning her body? They do indeed. Yeah. Why are we naked? What's going on? Where the fuck did you come from? Oh, magical girl transformation, yeah. Nice. Just put the robe on for no reason? Okay. Who is this... Na Who is this naked chick? Is that the one Rimuru absorbed? Who is this? These goblins are fucking these guys up. Oh, see, there's Shion back from the sun. <laughs> Only took her a whole episode. Y'all gonna have a good fight with her. Did he say that really? Did he? Did he say it in those words? That ain't no problem. They're actually talking to Alba here. Oh, so they are actually talking out here. Y'all, you just could you just reiterate what the message said? Nothing, literally nothing. Y'all want the smoke? All right, Benny Mario, get him. I thought that just like hit his abs or something, and he just bounced off them. That's crazy. Everybody get in their fights. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah that, that is what she is. Where does someone with a haircut like you get off making demands, Mr. Redhead? Oh, wicked, Oni. <laughs> nice. Filthy evil monster. Okay. Uh, now we're just being racist. Are you going to send bubble beam at me? Yeah. Flick. Goodbye. Baseball. See you later. <laughs> Y'all fucked up fighting this woman. <laughs> oh shit, here we go. Hell yeah. Which is a problem for you. Oh, she's throwing this Dragon Buster sword now. Spirit power? Oh, she's like, like an armor? What is this? Oh, wow. She's, she was a fairy. <laughs> oh, shit. Mm, was it though? Is it just mis mis miscommunication here, yeah, hmm? Is it like a really odd angle? No, it is an odd angle. I thought it was like just really short. Oh, let me just infuse this with Haki. One minute. <laughs> While I'm still being nice. While I haven't moved from this spot yet. Y'all sweating. You need to relax. Is she gonna do- is she gonna knock you guys out of a rock? Well, you should start. 
Did she just blast this man's ear off? <laughs> Holy shit. That could have been through your skull. How about you stand down? That's fair. Yeah, that makes sense. If you can't do it with your most powerful attack, there's no point in trying. He's pissed off because he's down one ear at the moment. <laughs> she, I'm just smiling there. Oh, multi-layer barrier. All-seeing eye. Magic sense. Unique skill. Master chef. <laughs> she just cut that and shit. That shit in half. That was really your strongest attack. That was kind of pathetic. I'm not gonna lie. What, she's just going to knock that shit out. You need to relax. We'll, we'll heal your ear. It's fine. There's something like... Messing with his emotions? Of course, she'd just be able to break that shit. Wow. <laughs> and y'all are about to be cooked. Really? Wow. Good. Smart. So the guys that have started this little mini war now know that's Rimuru just wanted to speak. I still think we should send Veldora to these guys. Knock on the door, be like, hello. Missed communication. Sorry, bro, you got used. You're kind of dumb, not gonna lie. But, I get it. Ooh, that backhand. Damn, Rimuru's actually kind of struggling here. True. He has not been here for that long. He has not been a warrior for that long. Because I'm too awkward. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, you stabbed this drip. I diminish your energy. Okay. Overwrite rules. Oh, so it's like the thing um, Shion and Co were talking about. Well, I could have guessed that. Jeez. Oh, a little bit of slime came out there. Predict future attack acquired. Bro, he's got armament and observation hacky now. Oh my god. Have you? Have you won this? She are just walking these guys. Yeah, he got slapped up by Benny Mara. They got slapped up by, by the Beasketeers. She's falling for him, apparently. Yeah. Nope. No, she did not. No sour grapes. Yeah, damn right. Oh, there we go. Mm, see? These damn fucking deep fake messages. See, he said it all kindly as well. You'd easily copy it. What is she doing? Is he just going to eat this? Indefensible? Sacrificing? She said sacrifice, Beelzebub? And he tanked that shit. Let's go. 
Where's Hinata? Oh, behind him. <laughs> Wait, did he get hit by that? <laughs> oh god, what happened? That dragon sword still in the background. Oh god, what? Explosion imminent? No fucking way someone's gonna... What is this? Are you fucking joking? Are you serious? Heal her. Are you serious? <laughs> you can't end the episode like that. I'm pissed off at that ending. I knew that there was something with that fucking sword. Ah. Okay, well, hang on. No, wait. I was gonna... Right, so e the outcomes here are she gets healed. Um, I was going to say she'd do what uh, Rimuru did with Valdora, and he'd kind of use, was it Beelzebub, to kind of swallow her up and do something about that, but then did he not just sacrifice Beelzebub? I don't know. That's that's what Raphael said. Or she dies here, and then a war starts because of this damn sword and these damn elders. These seven days, bastards. Um... Damn. Okay, well, that was a good episode. Um, I'm glad it, they kind of resolved it in a sense. Like, they did talk it out. She hit him with her strongest attack. He ate that. Raphael knows why. We don't know why. Um, but yeah, now we get, we get to see what's going to happen in the next episode. You might die here. Hopefully not. But the, yeah, these, these old dudes need to be sorted out. And like I said, just send Veldora to the front door. And I'm sure they will give in but overall a very good episode and i'm definitely looking forward to the next anyway guys i want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction have a nice rest of your day and peace out